What is prediabetes? Prediabetes means your blood sugar level is high but not high enough to be called diabetes. The American Diabetes Association criteria to diagnose prediabetes are as follows. First, impaired fasting glucose means plasma-plasting glucose between 100 and 125 mg per deciliter. Second, impaired glucose tolerance meaning 2-hour plasma glucose value during a 75 gram oral glucose tolerance test between 140 and 199 mg per deciliter. And third, hemoglobin A1c of 5.7 to 6.4%. If the diagnostic test is consistent with prediabetes, it should be repeated yearly. People with prediabetes usually do not have any symptoms. That is why it is important to have blood tests. However, if you have symptoms of dry mouth, excessive thirst, being hungry all the time, and excessive urination, you may be reaching the stage of diabetes. Risk factors for prediabetes include being overweight, family history of diabetes, over 45 years of age, high blood pressure, not being active enough, being of African American, American Indian, Asian American, Hispanic, or Pacific Islander descent, diabetes during pregnancy, and polycystic ovary syndrome. If you have any of these risk factors, you should be screened for prediabetes. One out of every two people with prediabetes will develop diabetes within 10 years of being diagnosed with prediabetes. The risk of prediabetes can be reduced by even a small amount of weight loss. This can be done by healthy eating and being active. Write down everything you eat. Keep a journal, food diary, or web app to help count calories. Use smaller plates and bowls. When you eat out, ask for a to-go box at the start of the meal. Put half the meal in the box for the next day. Don't watch TV, talk on the phone, or browse the web while eating. Eating less of all foods, not just sugar, can help you lower your risk of diabetes. Being active will lower your blood sugar levels, help you lose weight, help your balance and lower your risk of falls, reduce your stress, increase your feeling of well-being, help you control your blood pressure, and help you increase your good cholesterol. Make increased activity a habit that you will enjoy. Try dancing, walking, swimming, or riding a bicycle. Park farther away from stores or work. You'll walk more. Take the stairs instead of the elevator or escalator. Get started. Be active 10 minutes a day, 3 days a week. Thank you for listening. Be healthier.